Alrighty folks, welcome back to the Maverick Dynasty. Today we got Navy. They are 0-3, surprisingly. Kirk Herbstreet's picking us. And it looks like for Navy, they are throwing the ball. So I'm thinking we're going to go in kind of a goal line set because they uh, and see if they're running the triple option like they usually are in real life. But their quarterback here, Morris, has actually thrown the ball a bit. So I'm not sure what they're doing here. Yeah, Navy's probably like my second favorite team and second or third favorite team in real life because they're just, it's always fun to watch that triple option offense and like no passing. Oh, and the blocks line up. Jason gets a nice block out there. And Jake on his first carry of the day, 25 yards. You cannot ask for a better hole to be opened up with a line there. Beautiful freaking blocking. Jason right there and just a beautiful block. The entire offensive line is killing it. And Kenneth Bray drops that one. Heavy contact. Good play by number 12. And Harvey gets drove into the ground, but he gets 10 yards. You would think they would be ready for this option offense, considering they got to go against it every week. And I'm just going to scramble out here, get that first down, put his head down, 12 freaking yards. I probably had some guys open, but I was just like, screw it, let's go. And Wayne... Goes to those creases, 10 freaking yards. Good throw by Chance Fitzpatrick there. And Jason picks up another key block. Jake's going to take it for 11 yards. The offensive line, this first drive, just absolutely killing it. And perfect block. Harvey dives over the freaking defender into the end zone. What a freaking block by our receiver there, or our tight end. Oh, gotta make that tackle. Good play by Ferris to bring him down. It's interesting, they're coming out in kind of a spread formation. Usually they run this triple option, but I don't know what the hell is going on here. And he makes a bad throw there. It looks like Zach Thornton was there to freaking toss that one down. Ooh, and I took a bad angle, and then he runs over uh, Jeremy Thompson there, just absolutely flattened his ass. I took a that was probably on me because I took a bad angle. And I'm trying to string him out, but I just don't got any help on the inside to bring him down. We have got to get something figured out on defense here. We can't score 70 points a game every time. See, I was trying to string him out, but there was just no help. The inside just got destroyed. Ooh, and I bit on that one hard too. And Bradford, I think, as well, as Chip Hines pushed him out. And, oh no, oh my god, Harrington got in my way. We get him in the backfield. This defense has got to learn how to tackle. We are not going to be able to do anything if we can't stop this Heisman cheese. And they do not have the speed on the D-line. Good block downfield. And I'm going to run this one out of bounds. Harvey is killing it. 24 yards on the ground. Oh, bad play by me. Thank God number 12 has hands of bricks. That was a dumb play by me. And they bit on it. Harvey, can he get that first down? He gets pushed by the other team. They have gone complete full retard and push him forward. Five carries, 74 yards. Keep that drive moving. And Jake, another nine yards. This offensive line is holding steady today. And Jake goes ahead for five yards. They were ready for me to take that one with the quarterback. Ooh, Alvarez gets absolutely laid out and can't hold on to that one. I don't. We have just not had a lot of... Success to the air today. Oh, I should not have thrown that. Oh, thank God, number 12. Two deflections. He is just... Number 12, I'm going to get you later in this game, prick. 
Yep, there it is. Alvarez, nice play. Fuck you, number 12. Alvarez, first catch for 11 yards. Good play, number 38 or 18. I can't even... 18. Kevin Brenneman. Okay, buddy. And nothing doing there. No. No, 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 no. That... I don't even... Um... And the running back is just going to the right side for some reason. And just no block shedding here. We've got help, you know, we've got better talent on the field, but we are not able to break off. It might just be because Navy is so damn strong. Somebody makes the hit, somebody tackles, somebody please for the love of God. I might just, um, if it, if they run hurry up, I might just get the goal line. I might honestly just get the goal line set out here for the rest of the game. And I screwed up the user on that one. And I had to... Ah. Oh, man. The Mavericks defense today just playing like absolute shit again. I don't know what can be done to fix this defense. And Adam Wayne gets out there, has the kicker to beat, he can't get past him. That is unfortunate. But beautiful return by Adam Wayne there. Alvarez again, nine yards. Oh, and beautiful, almost, I, I almost could have been over to that one for a touchdown if things had lined up. Beautiful blocks there, and Jake cutting through for five. Adam Wayne gets out there. Down to the nine yard line, 18 yard reception. His man went in for the blitz. And the safety couldn't get over there on time number 11. What a play. Ah, oh, man, again I accidentally got past the line of scrimmage. I think our one was open. But I got out too quick. <laughs> 96 is fast as hell. Alvarez gets wide open on his drag route. Number 9. Chance Fitzpatrick, our backup quarterback, with the touchdown. So good to see him in the game after he's taken the benching pretty well after being the starter for all last year. And he's been a solid backup for us. Beautiful play, brought him down for two yards. Who was that? Devin Key, tackle for loss. Bad position now. And, oh my god, we got a tip. And that could be a punt. The first punt I've seen in, in years. This is amazing. They could fake it, though. Beautiful blocking there, seven yards for Jake. And Jake is just dicing through that defense, 11 yards. That was some really patient running, looking like Le'Veon Bell out there, waiting for his blockers to set up. Give me that block number 80, thank you. And he gets a 23 yarder, I should have probably went out of bounds to avoid the fumble there. of the end zone, Stephen Hills, our fifth receiver, Chance Fitzpatrick, lays out an absolute dime. What a freaking play. Stephen Hills in the end zone. He doesn't get in the game much, but he made his freaking play count there. Number 19. And Chance is on fire today. And Lewis there forcing the pressure. He just threw that one like a, like a wounded duck going through the middle of the field. And the pressure gets there. He's going down for a loss of one. Who was that? Number 56, Nick Ferris with a sack. 
I don't know why, but I feel like I do better when I use the, the defensive line instead of screwing up a coverage. Ooh, when they get him. What a freaking play. Open over the middle. Their mascot's going berserk. And they're running that option. And who was that? Zach Thornton, I think, just got bulldozed. Another seven yards for CJ Williams. Yeah, Na this Navy team is so interesting because they're still running some read options and stuff, but they're 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 passing the ball a lot more frequently. So beautiful play. Who was that? We know it's a white guy, Antonio Daniel, the safety. That's a rare thing for the Mavericks to get a tackle on the first attempt, but he brought him down. And number 54 gets there, stops him to a fourth and one. They are going to go for the field goal. I wonder if they have the leg for it. I did not check their kicker stats. He does not. Alvarez will have a chance to return this one. Get going, Alvarez. Come on, we can get past him. And he does, oh man, it's so tough, running into my own blocker, but we're going to get it at the 45-yard line. I love how that counts that as a turnover. And the blocking holds up. Jake just runs into a guy and gets seven yards. Beautiful play. And Crenshaw with that beautiful break. Going to get 18 yards on it. Ooh, just 78 missed his block there, and that's going to be a loss of one. And number 50, this white linebacker thinks he's good. 78, man. He got to make that block. And Jake's going to plow forward seven yards. We are in field goal range, and we just need points on this drive. Circles wide open. Kenneth Bray down to the freaking 10-yard line. Bray's first catch of the day, second catch of the day. And they make number 67 with a key block there. Jake throws that defender off like a pile of shit. He does not give a shit about your family. Jake wanted that touchdown. Stephen Hill's over there to celebrate with him. Beautiful blocking. Perfect execution. Beautiful tackle, Norris Bradford. Only a gain of four. And Lewis gets there, forces the throw away. Number 35, Jeremy Thompson, playing some lockdown coverage. Jeremy Thompson has been one of the most interesting players to watch for this Mavericks team. Him and Chip Hines, two freshmen just balling out so far. Another throw away on third down. This quarterback, get him the hell out of the game. Thompson again, celebrating with Daniel. The freshmen are running wild. It looks like the Navy offense has bogged down. They are just a shell of their former selves, it looks like. And Alvarez gets it some open space. I don't know if he's going to be able to take it in, but he gets us down to the 31. Beautiful return by Keithy Alvarez. Putting us in almost in field goal range right away. Oh, why did you... Oh, my God. Who got the tackle there. Number 78 gets the tackle. I I gotta... That's weird, okay? They don't continue on the slant. That is unfortunate, so I gotta stop throwing it when they... Because for some reason on that slant, he stops it after a certain point and just stands there, so I can't throw that one anymore. But luckily, we got a two-possession lead. Let's see if the defense can continue slaughtering this offense. And number 58 here, Devin Key with the sack. We are all over this one. Oh my god, Chip Hines, you gotta pay attention, son. Chip Hines was watching his receiver, but he did not have his eyes on the quarterback. He ran straight past that one. He had good coverage initially, but he ran right past him. 
And that tight end, man. Hard to stop. And who was that, Antonio Daniel, the freaking freshman safety? You'd love to see it. He makes another tackle for loss. This guy has been clutch all game with those tackles. Ah, you had to turn around, son. He's going to get that first down. We need to punish this motherfucker for running like that. And just not enough push. He'll get in for the touchdown. That's going to make this game unfortunately close. So now I'm going to have to pull something out of this offense. Beautiful blocking there by that edge. Harvey gets the first down. My goal here is just to run the hell out of this clock. Get some points on the board. Whether it be a field goal or touchdown. And get us the hell out of this game. And they're going to play stupid. They had that all covered up, but Harvey is way too fast to leave that right side wide open. And oh, Huffman, 10 yards. The reason I'm groaning like a weirdo is because that left side was wide open if I could have hit it. Beautiful blocking by everybody there. Such great blocking. And Harvey's going to get another six-yard first down. They are pissed they can't stop Jonathan Harvey. Hilliard is coaching up this team. Somehow Harvey's on the bench, even though he just ran. And when the offense is on the field, that's an interesting little thing there. Good block in there. Seven yards for Harvey. Navy's wasting all their timeouts. Um, a first down here could seal it. But if not, we could always go to the field goal route. And Jake... Oh my goodness, Jake Marshall just turned into Marshawn Lynch in his prime there. And he's praying again. What a freaking play. I don't even know what I was doing as the user there, but that was crazy. He rifles it to the left. Chip Hines, ooh, pass deflection. He does not get the pick. Those are those white boy hands. You can't trust them. And Hooper gets there, but not in time. He throws in pass for negative one yards. This Navy offense. What in the hell are they trying to do here? They may have just given up. And he throws a pass behind the line of scrimmage. Number 54, at Carlos Atkins. Throws him down like a little child. Just... Navy just... This second half has just shit the bed on offense. What the hell were they thinking? Good play by Carlos Atkins. More perfect blocks by the O-line. Jake goes for 12. I want more points because I, w getting beat down all that first season, I want to rub this one in somebody's face. Navy can just eat this loss. Or maybe they'll pick it off. Who knows? Ooh. That linebacker with that hop. What a play. There you go. There's some moral points for you, you little scumbags. Wiggins with the interception. Good play, young man. At least you can show that one off to your mama. But you will not be winning this game. And again, Carlos Atkins comes and swats that one down. He Chip Hines looked back for that. Ooh, he overthrew it by a, about a foot. This is a weird defense. We got Harrington and Dodd out here on the defensive line. Interesting formation sub by NCAA. Antonio Daniel cannot get the pick there. So many white corners and safeties just dropping passes today. That is unfortunate. And they're going to run a stupid little route into the flat from McBride. That's going to end the game. Yeah, where are you guys hurrying up to? Get the hell out of here. This is our stadium. Just a great performance by the team all around. 
I feel like we just came out and played with him. Jake Marshall wins player of the game. I felt like we were kind of just toying with him. The defense that came out and held him under, uh, under 25 points. That's really good. Harvey there just diving like a psychopath with no regard for his own life. Stats on the day. Chance Fitzpatrick finishes 5 for 8 for 31 yards, 2 touchdowns, 1 interception. And Harvey was 9 for 15 for 75 yards and an interception. The interceptions were kind of just me playing around. God, if I know math, we only got about 100, a little over 100 yards passing. So that's a very interesting day from the offense. John Harvey on the ground, 17 for 179, a touchdown. Jake had 16 carries, 119 yards, two, and two touchdowns. They both had an incredible average, 10.5 and 7.4 as well as Huffman, two carries, 18 yards, a nine average, and Rouse had a carry for two yards. Again, through the air, we didn't have too much going on. Alvarez was five for 31 and a touchdown. Adam Wayne was two for 28. Bray, two for 14. Crenshaw, one for 18. Hills had that one touchdown for 15 yards. Culliver had a catch for two yards, and Jake had one for one. And we had no sacks given up. And Carlos Atkins, probably the defensive player of the game for us. He had 10 total tackles. Nick Ferris had two tackles for a loss, one was a sack. Antonio Daniel had two tackles for a loss. Devin Key, two tackles for a loss, one was a sack. And Carlos Atkins had a tackle for loss. And Chip Hines had a deflection, as well as Antonio Daniel. And Alvarez had that punt return for 31 yards. And taking a look at recruiting, the punter we're running away with. TJ Scott, the kicker, running away with. Corey West, doing pretty well. And Jamal McPherson, he was a, a three-star recruit. We weren't really on his board, but he's a pretty solid defensive end. He's a gem. He had a plus seven overall. 83 power moves, 81 finesse, 78 block shedding. This guy would be a menace. And John Gray, we're taking the lead over North Carolina. Alrighty, so next up, we got Marshall Thundering Herd, one of my favorite games we play every year. Kirk is picking us this year, which is nice to see. And their offense looking, oh my god, Isaiah Green's playing like a, out of his mind. Tyler King, Xavier Gaines, that looks more like the actual Marshall in real life from last season. But, not with Green though, but we shall see, and that's going to do it for this video. Peace out.